What up, everybody? I'm Jason. Jocelyn. And we are here again at Disneyland to show the opening day of Halloween. But we won't order a lot of stuff. I'm excited. Yeah, and I hope we can make the window because let me show you guys. This is the security line all the way back to the back. So yeah, that is what we deal with, where we are dealing with right now. So when we get in, oh my God. We're gonna shoot a few things and we're going to enjoy some food. But if you haven't already, exactly, try a few things. But if you haven't already, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys like the video and as I say, smash it. And make sure you guys hit that bell for notifications. Let's go. All right, guys, we are sitting here waiting for Jazz. Jazz is in the bathroom right now, but uh, it took 25 minutes to get through security. We had to change our time window for our- Everything we ordered. <laughs> Everything like we ordered. Yeah, so um, it pushed our time back a little bit. We didn't think it, it was gonna be this crazy, but it's, it's crazy. So if you guys coming anytime this weekend, be patient, please be patient. We don't need another fantastic fight. <laughs> but, all right, we're just gonna sit here and wait for Jazz and then we're gonna head inside. First one that we are trying today is the Pumpkin King Cold Brew in that we got this from the Royal Street Veranda, it's in the New Orleans Square. So the Pumpkin King Cold Brew consists of Joffrey's Pumpkin Cream Brulee Cold Brew with pumpkin spiced creamer, skeleton, chocolate on the top. It's decoration, it says on the deco. Okay, so let's try it. Okay, Disney, I see you. It's actually really delicious. It's coffee, so but we're gonna let Jazz take a sip. And let her take a sip, bitch. Let her take a sip, and then she wants the Jack Skeleton on top. That was a drink, ma'am. That wasn't no sip. Did you see her eyes? Did yeah, she mean? said, this is what they be drinking? Okay. You want to try to like, let me taste it. It's pretty good. What do you want me to do? You want to mix it up and see to put the stuff in there and see if it changes the taste? I like, mix it up good. Maybe. I'm mixing the toffee chips in there. This lighting on you is like demure. 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 Very cutesy. Very cutesy. <laughs> <laughs> I sound like I'm too Very demure. Very demure. It tastes the same. Tastes the same? Yeah. Okay. It's really good. It's actually really refreshing. I guess when I think like coffee or like, especially like sweet like this, I think it's like. My mind automatically goes to creamy, but this is actually refreshing, more refreshing than it is. Like, there's no creaminess to it. But. Yeah, she's not a coffee drinker. I am. This is very good. The chocolate was very good. Chocolate was a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Okay, so the next one we're trying is the banana graveyard funnel cake, or the graveyard banana. So I'm actually really excited about this because I think banana funnel cake and I think amazing. So let's take a look. Oh, in the graveyard banana funnel cake, it's banana cream, chocolate cookie dust, Halloween candy, whipped topping, and spray stuff. It's a lot of stuff. I'm excited. <laughs> And Jazz is cutting her piece. Because I was trying to get the funnel cake and not very far. 
<laughs> she still won't. She stuck. Wasn't letting us slow it down. Um, excuse me. Okay. How was it? She got that banana flavor in there, that, that back, mm -hmm. last minute. 10 out of 10, she said. Okay, overall, what would you give the cold brew? The cold brew, I would say, is, for me, is a 10 out of 10, as well as this funnel cake. 10 out of 10? It was busting. Like, like, so I gave it like a seven. Wasn't the best, but also wasn't. You, the this worst. is the only one that you've tasted. How do you know what's the best? No, no my fault. We have to give me some coffee. Oh. Coffee. Yeah. Okay. I'm on the All right. Now it's my turn to try it, but guys, hold on. All right, guys. So we're gonna go try some more stuff. We more over. We yeah. We mobile ordered more stuff, so we're gonna go try that right now. Um, so mainly jazz Yay! and Dawson and Jocelyn are going to be trying the food. I'm just going to be holding the camera because I got to be with this little guy. See how mad he got right now. So, all right, let's go. All right, guys, so just for that funnel cake, we're pretty full already. That was a lot. That was a lot of funnel cake. Very sweet, but it delicious. Good, it was delicious. So we're going to go get our popcorn bucket, actually, and then we're going to head to uh, DCA after that. So let's go. All right, guys, so popcorn bucket secured well in our case the french fry bucket is secured it's pretty cool it lights up and everything and jazz got the fries and sharing with guy all right we're heading to dca to get the rest of our stuff we mobile order so let's roll guys the first thing that we're trying is the oogie boogie apple lemonade so it has cherry flavored popping obas and raspberry sauce this is before mixing it, so let's just try it like that. Is it sweet? Very tart, very Ooh. sour. Okay, try it without mixing it, Jess. Let's see what Jess say. Ooh. I can handle sour, and this is sour. Ooh, okay, before you mix it, with a one out of 10. Like a five. I agree. My five? five? Okay, let's mix it. Like, like the aftertaste, I don't it have tastes good. Mm -hmm. Oh, very good. The aftertaste, it tastes good. Yeah. The aftertaste tastes good? Yeah. But like the beginning, it's sour. Mix it in a little bit. It turns gray. Mm. It's the same? And I don't think we, I mentioned this guys, but this is actually from Smoke Dumpers. So the two items we're having right now is from Smoke Dumpers. So with, the next item we're trying is the Villainous Double Cheeseburger. So it's a double cheeseburger with pepper jack, chili peppers, arugula, spicy aioli. That, that's how you say it. Aioli. Aioli, served with crinkle cup fries. So, smells good. That's cilantro though. It's not cilantro, it's arugula. Oh, oh arugula. Yeah. It looks like it's not front okay. cilantro. Let's try it. Why is it in? That was a bite of all bites right there. This might be one of the best burgers I've ever tried in my life. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> my turn, my turn, my turn. Okay. Leave it up to the like judge. That. Like everything is just like the, so flavorful. It's just, it, I worked. Don't know it worked. No words. It worked. Disney knew what they were doing with this one. Two out of ten. It's it's so amazing. Infinity and out of ten. Guys, look at this. 
they take your shoe off and everything? Everything, shoes off and everything. It's like infinity out there. You gotta try this. I'll try this one, I'll try this one. I am the burger guy, I guess. Yeah. That's a big bite. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> he needs to sit up. <laughs> no. What do you think? I'm gonna go talk to the chef. <laughs> Could I have a bus. <laughs> you bus and bus. Did I tell you or did I tell you? It's about a, it's about a 20 out of 20. 20 out of 20. No, 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 a pity out of 20. Yeah, because this is actually really good. Like, the flavors go together. Like, I got, every single I got thing like that a, they chose for this burger. I got like a garlicky, like, yeah. taste to it, yeah. but it, it doesn't say, I mean, I mean, unless the aioli has, has garlic in it, but. But it every just, single item that they chose for this burger pairs very well with this burger. Yeah. Seasoned and. Honestly, it's worth the money. I'm, like, how much was it? It was uh, sixteen forty nine. With Honestly, your magic key discount. You yeah, you're looking done. at like fourteen bucks. We have the Inspire, so you're looking at like fourteen bucks, maybe. Approximately. Yeah. So honestly, this burger is worth it. Like, probably just go off a of lunch or something like that, and I will come here and just get this. So definitely come and pick this up. Worth it. I told you. Alrighty, guys. So the next item on our list is the stuff fondue. It's cream filled and it has strawberries. So it's pretty simple. Pretty straightforward. Pan dulce with strawberries and cream. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, you, gotta, you gotta take a bite in like a sandwich. Oh. Like a big cream strawberry sandwich. This is hard picking up because it breaks easily. Use the fork. Oh, no, you got it. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> Is it good? It looked good. <laughs> it looked worth it. Okay. okay, it's mama's turn. I'm not trying that. That's too much sugar for me. So, okay. it's like, it's like, um, it does have a, like, ever tried like a goncha or something. So like, basically the goncha is the bread. And the inside part is like with cream and strawberry so Isn't that like a perfect thing? Like it's a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. You heard it first from Jazz. 10 out of 10. Okay. Whoosh. Is it good? It is super sweet. You got the sweetness from the bread, the cream, and the strawberry, so it is pretty sweet. But it's, it's amazing. I would rate it a solid 8 out of 10. From the studio catering company, we have the cucumber mint lemonade. So, straightforward cucumber mint lemonade, and it has uh, blueberries on top. So. Like the mint and the cucumber are balanced out, so you get the equal like flavorings. Of and what was the, what, what was on top? The berries? Blueberries. Yeah. Blueberries. That sounds like a uh, like Antioxidant. a yeah. It sounds like a mint julep like almost. Cucumbers. Yeah. Oh, it, yeah. It yeah, kind of like a mint julep. Cucumbers. Yeah. Except mint juleps don't have cucumbers. Correct. So that's the only thing. It's like mint julep. It, it, it's like it's cucumber. It's very balanced. It's just like if cucumber would be a drink. We are going to be trying the Asian inspired spicy pork taco. So it has kimchi, cucumber, carrots, pickled onions, and sriracha aioli. So that sounds like a like, real spicy. Yeah. Because I heard that kimchi is already spicy. Okay, let's give it a try. And it's on flour tortillas, so it's a flour. Flour tortilla taco. <laughs> Just like my turn. Really all 
Oh, Wait, go ahead. Go ahead, man. Disneyland really outdid themselves with the food this time. It's, everything has been like. Well, everything that we chose. Yeah, that we chose. Yeah, they have some other <laughs> stuff, but it's, it's usually very sweet. I have some of the spicy and I, and I taste it with my finger. <laughs> it's not that spicy. All right, test turn. It reminds me of like the bon mi. Mm. Yeah. In a taco version? Okay. All right, guys. We're going to finish this up and then we're going to head out from here. Alright guys, so that was it for our Halloween adventure for opening night, opening day of it. We didn't go through the day I had to work, so we came at night. So it's yeah. okay though. It was good. I feel like we waited maybe waited less or do we probably you think we waited more because a lot of people just got off work and just No, came. I think it was kinda hectic this morning. I watched a lot of people lives and stuff and it was very very hectic. Yeah. But um I hope you guys hopefully you guys enjoyed the food that we uh, uh showed and we stuff enjoyed it we too. enjoyed it um try try every single one of those um only one for me was the um we did end up having to throw away a little bit of the pan dulce but again we were like, and the funnel cake the funnel cake yeah. it was a lot of sweet and it's i think that's the one that was the kicker thing. for me for like i was like uh i wouldn't get again uh yeah you're right, right. everything else was amazing what about you moms um, what, 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 what was your least favorite what was your least favorite Bondusa. Okay, what was your favorite? The, the, the little kimchi one. The, the, the tacos? The tacos? The tacos. The tacos. The, the burger was for me. Yeah, mine's too. Definitely mine's the burger. Down. Definitely oh, the burger. This can turn on now since it's at a darker place. It is, but let's wait until we get home so we won't waste, waste the battery. Okay. But, all right, guys. Oh, yes, that popcorn bucket, if you guys do get it, um, it does run, I think, $31.99. Thir no, it was $33.50, but then when you get $33.50. Magic, magic key it goes down to 31 and a little lanyard that comes with it but um i would like to um say thank you to our cast member friends that you know hooked us up with that and so really, really appreciate it, appreciate it yeah. um that being said make sure you guys hit that like button make sure you guys subscribe and make sure you guys hit that bell for notifications i'm jason you guys excited to try oh there you there we go yeah. where are you guys excited to try it let us know in the comments but uh, I'm Jason. I'm Jocelyn. I'm Jocelyn. And we're and baby Kai down there. <laughs> and we're the Alphas. Peace. <laughs>